So another crop that I'm growing in this greenhouse is this old English variety of tomato called King George. And it was available commercially many years ago, but is now has gone out of use and it is in the Heritage Seed Library. And as a seed guardian, they ask me to grow on particular crops for them for the seed. So when the tomato is perfectly ripe, I then pick them and harvest the seed and eat the pulp. Some tomatoes are full of seeds and others have very few. All I do is I cut them into sections, the tomatoes, and then I scoop out whatever seed I can find and save the pulp, which I can use to make um, passata or ketchup or uh, all sorts of things. Use it for cooking. It's absolutely lovely. Here is where the seeds are and they're in this rather jelly-like watery substance and that is what one has to get rid of and the way you do it is by fermenting the seeds and once the membrane is gone the seeds are then able to germinate so mother nature is a clever thing because the membrane effectively acts as a form of birth control <laughs> and, uh, until it's disappeared the seed won't grow and these seeds are all going to go into the Heritage Seed Library once I've cleaned them and dried them. So now I'm just going to give it a quick rinse under cold water. Basically scoop all my seed into the jar, put a little bit of water in, really good shake and now I'm going to leave that for a few days. So, what have we got here? Okay, well, my, my, my worst fears are confirmed. Um, and this is something that I was suspecting, is that actually the seed that farmers are now buying, or even smallholders and small growers are yeah. buying, are coming from Thailand. This is all Thai um, seed, and also from China. And yeah, here they are. Platinum 701 F1 hybrid. Probably does really well here, really good commercial crop to grow. But that's what everybody is now growing. So finding the local varieties and continuing to grow them is really, really important because within a very short space of time, they'll be lost if we don't do it because everybody will grow this. This is what I want. Perfect. So that's a, re that's a really, really good tomato for me to take home. So, I've got a, so I've, I'll scoop out the seeds, put it in a bag and put it in the bottom of my suitcase. And by the time I get home, it'll be fermented nicely and I can then rinse it and wash it. And this I will definitely try and grow next year. Thank you.